Thank you for clicking on the video. If you are watching this, I am in South Carolina right now, but I wanted to make sure I got this Q&A recorded and up for you guys so you would have something to watch. And there won't be any workout footage of you're looking for that. Sorry, I won't be in this video, but I did post a Q&A on my social media, so make sure you're following me on that on Instagram and Twitter at G underscore fitness online. So I'm very active on there. Make sure you check that out so you know what's happening. That's where I set up this Q&A. First, we have a package, so why not start off with that? So, not sure if you can see me because the light is pretty bright outside. It's such a nice day. But what I want to tell you guys about this, if you haven't heard of it already, it's called fitnessdealnews.com. And what it does is it searches all the, the best fitness websites and everything, all the products, and puts it into one place, all the deals, promotions, promotional codes, all that stuff. And it'll send it to you, the hottest thing, whatever's new that day. Searches it and puts it into one place for you. So that's anything from supplements, protein bars, powders, all that stuff. Uh, equipment, apparel, anything, all in one place. It's very good, highly recommend it. Got an email a few days ago that it was a buy one, get one free. So this is how I came across these two boxes of the Combat Crunch Bar from Muscle Farm. Cinnamon Twist, haven't tried this before, so looking forward to that. And then I also got the cookies and cream, which I have had before, so I'm excited to have that. But I want to tell you guys because this was buy one get one free deal. You don't get that very often. And a little freebie also came with the BPI Pump HD. So I'm sure I'll try that in a future video. So again, that is fitnessdealnews.com. That will be in the description box below. So check them out. Highly recommend it. Great deals. Can't pass them up. Let's get to the Q&A. First question, what's your major? So I'm an elementary education major, also a social and behavioral major with a minor in psychology. So it's a double major and a minor. Nothing to do with fitness or exercise or anything like that, but that's just what I ended up doing. I love teaching and that's what I stuck with, but I do want to end up in fitness. Question number two, favorite music to listen to while working out? Honestly, this changes from day to day, workout to workout. Um, when, honestly, when Justin Bieber's album came out, I was listening to that. Country music is my absolute favorite music, but I will not listen to that while I work out. So it's really whatever music is new, or sometimes when I need some extra motivation, I will listen to Fearless Motivation. You can check them out on YouTube, and they're also on Instagram as well. Very motivational. It's kind of motivational speaking, but in a singer-song lyric version. Very good. I highly recommend it. So that's Fearless Motivation. I will listen to them a lot. Favorite all-time movie? This is an oldie and it would have to be Ferris Bueller's Day Off. I don't know what it is about the movie, but absolutely love it. So Ferris Bueller's Day Off, favorite all-time movie. Question number four. What are some of your fitness goals? This is kind of a broad subject of fitness goals because it could be what I want to do personally or it could be in my lifts. Um, overall, personally, in my lifts, I want to get stronger. I want to back away from more of the endurance training that I would do for soccer because I played soccer in college. So I want to get away from that and just over build overall strength. And you know, I want it to look like I do lift. And you know, just because I'm a girl, no, I will not look like a man. But just overall strength, I want to build up, increase on all of my lifts. Fitness goals that has to deal with kind of YouTube and everything, is definitely to take this channel to the next level, reach as many people as I can, and people I mean, girls, boys, of any age, any ability, any level, just if someone can learn one thing from my channel, from what I do on social media, and that is really my ultimate goal. Favorite workout you like to do? Oh, this is a tough question. I would probably have to say, I do enjoy leg day just because there's a lot of different things that you can do, so I'd have to go with that. Um, really just any time in the gym is a good time. Next question. What is your previous one rep max? So unfortunately I do not have any one rep maxes at the moment because when I did start lifting it was in college and it was all programmed by our strength 
trainers that we were assigned to our team. So we had one for soccer, and everyone had a different one for whatever sport you were on. So they never took the time to test our one rep maxes. It was just based off, of, okay, maybe this is your position, this is your height, and this is your body build. You're gonna do this when we squat, you're gonna do this when, we never bench pressed actually. Um, we never deadlift, so we really just squatted, but we never tested anything. It was just kind of here, this is what you're gonna do. If it works, cool, if it doesn't, okay, let's change it. But if you stay tuned to this series, this Back in Business series, at the end of February, the final episode will be me testing my one rep maxes, and then after that, I will figure out what program I want to do and use my one rep maxes for the bench squat and deadlift and base that program off of that. So that will be the final episode of the back in business. Very good question. What year are you? So I am a senior in college currently at Seton Hall University where I played division one soccer. I'll graduate in May which will be pretty nice so again I am a senior. Another question, how did you get started in fitness? And honestly, this is easy because I've always been active ever since I was little, playing all kinds of sports. I played three sports in high school. So really wasn't anything for me to get into because I was, I've was i always been running and lifting weights, starting in college and everything. So it's just kind of something that I did my whole life. And now that I'm sort of done playing, I still want to continue the active part and continue lifting and running so all of that. What is my favorite color? Favorite color and green no doubt gotta love green. Do you have any advice for someone trying to get into lifting? This was from a girl so for, especially from a girl's perspective is don't be afraid to step into a gym. Don't feel like you have to go in the corner or you just need to do the booty workouts or you know lift light weights. Have a plan, look up things online, watch other YouTubers, something, find something that you like and be confident when you go into the gym. The gym should be a place that you feel comfortable, it doesn't cause you any stress, it's maybe a way to go relieve stress. Because when you're in there, everyone in there is trying to better themselves in one way or another. So advice for a girl is just kind of an idea of what you want to do but don't, and don't be afraid to do it. That's probably the best thing I can do. And, Yes, you're going to start off slower and you know not as lifting as much as you want, obviously, but everything takes time. If it's worth it, it will take time. What is your favorite thing to make? All right, well, it's kind of a vague question, but favorite thing to make would have to be something that's breakfast-related, because breakfast I could eat for all meals, every day, all day. But I would have to say something like, pancakes would have to be my favorite or a very complex oatmeal with a bunch of fixings and toppings. So that's going to do it for this Q&A. Got a few questions. Hope I answered all of them. If you have any more questions or want me to elaborate on anything that I mentioned in this video, please leave it in the comment box below. Give us a thumbs up if you did enjoy it. And again, thank you guys for watching this video, clicking on it. Hope you're having a great day. Stay tuned for the next video, which will be another one that I have planned for you guys because I'll still be away. Thank you all once again. Don't forget to check me out on social media. Stay tuned for the next video, and I'll see you guys next time.